our department, the nuclear department, is inside the materials department, but we have our nuclear science building. That is our main headquarters. Basically what a nuclear and radiological engineer is, is we work with uh, radioactive material um, to help develop and improve the use of this material uh, before, during, and after the reactor process. Traditionally, it's been focused on nuclear energy. The idea of using nuclear reactors uh, to generate electricity. Uh, a big area now which is growing is in to do with safety and safeguards and national security aspects of, of nuclear. We want to make sure that that uh, there's no uh, nuclear materials entering the country. So one of the things that we're working on and many people are working on now is, is interdiction, is detecting materials. How do you detect a pound or, or um, no, 10 pounds of nuclear material coming through a port which is processing thousands of containers, large containers a day? So the nuclear reactor that we have here on our campus is actually the first digital training reactor in the country. They may be working on designing a small modular reactor or a reactor which was uh, for, de for generating uh, hydrogen. Some of the career opportunities that you can do with nuclear engineering is you can go into the industry as either like a safety engineer where you improve the safety um, of handling and transporting the material before and after. Uh, you can be a reactor physicist where you work on the reactor, you know, the material during the reactor process. Um, and there's also, you know, programming. You can program the actual code in the nuclear reactor. Uh, there's also the medical field, where you can do what I want to do, where it's nuclear research, um, nuclear medicine, and radiology. And there's also um, military. You can go into the Navy is always recruiting for their nuclear propulsion program.